Today, I'd like to show you a utility that's contained within the SOLIDWORKS Utilities add-in that will help you simplify your geometry in preparation for analysis or simply for having uh, simplified configurations within a large assembly. Uh, so like I said, this is contained within the SOLIDWORKS Utilities add-in, so just make sure that you have that turned on uh, before you begin to use the Simplify tool. We'll go ahead and search for the Simplify tool since not many people know where it is. And for 2016, they've actually added this new tab uh, called Analysis Preparation, and they've added the Simplify tab right to that. So let's go ahead and activi activate that Simplify tool. And here we can see we can simplify either based on uh, feature parameters or the volume of the part. So let's go ahead and choose uh, feature parameters and click Find Now. And we can see that with a simplification factor of 0.05, SOLIDWORKS only finds that one fillet as an item to remove or a feature to remove for our simplification. Okay, so you can see it's that outer fillet right there. Probably wouldn't be necessary if we were doing some sort of simulation analysis on this part. So that's a great thing to simplify uh, in this geometry. When we go through and suppress that, we can choose to cr create um, a derived configuration if need be. In this case, uh, simplify one. And that gives us a great starting point where we can go through and use that as a simplified configuration, either for simulation analysis or just managing our large assembly. Uh, in addition to that, we can choose a volume-based uh, simplification here. And here you can see it'll find uh, significantly more. It actually picks up the two holes in this case, as well as that other fillet that we had uh, in this geometry. So again, just a great tool will help you uh, shrink down your model size and the amount of features contained within the tree and gives you a nice quick way to do it. Hope you enjoyed this and tune in next time.